The Archbishop of Canterbury has urged families in the Midlands to support one another during the financial downturn. Speaking about recent large-scale job losses, he said there's a pool of human excellence which somebody will want to use. Well, he made his comments during a visit to a new community centre in Birmingham. Ben Godfrey was there. Three-year-old Isaiah Khan can tell his friends he was making hats today with the Archbishop of Canterbury. Isaiah has joined the playgroup at the new Springfield Centre in Birmingham. What did he make of uh, meeting the Archbishop of Canterbury? Yeah, it was such a nice experience meeting him and, uh, and doing some activities with him. So uh, he really enjoyed with that and we did as well as a family of uh, my son. Dr Rowan Williams was visiting the city to talk about the importance of respect and the contribution of churches. And with hundreds of jobs being lost every week in the Midlands, he also had a message of hope for families experiencing tough times. I think I'd want to say support one another, be there for one another in a time like this. Don't forget that others are in the same problem, in the same situation, facing some of the same challenges, so be there for each other. Second thing is just remember there's, whether the jobs are there or not, there's a pool of skills, a pool of human excellence around that one of these days somebody will want to use. The Springfield Centre looks impressive. It costs almost £2 million to build. The Archbishop of Canterbury even managed a game of air hockey. I'm a bit nervous because uh, it was the last game where whoever scores was going to win and I, um, and I won and then he got, it goes good match and then they were upstairs. The Archbishop, on his first visit to the region in two years, will lead a service at St Philip's Cathedral tomorrow. Ben Godfrey, BBC Midlands Today. Birmingham.